a lot of people say this is their, uh, their favorite part of the show, believe it or not. I'm, I'm not one of them, but uh, <laughs> this is where we uh, destroy people's lives. <laughs> or at least play a small part. Tom? We're just helping. Your thoughts? Um, my thoughts are... Are we really? Okay. There she is. It's uh, the lovely Allie Breen, comedian. Yeah, we're saving relationships. That's we're right. Not just uh, and uh, Allie, where are you? I'm down at Fox. I'm doing some writing and work for them today on some shows. Oh, all right. Okay. So you're yeah. like in the coffee room or something? Pretty much, exactly. I'm in basically like a conference closet type thing. Okay, all right. Well, let's just get right to it. We're going to help people with their love troubles here in the Bob and Tom program. What have you got? Dear Allie, I've been dating a guy for six months. His mom was just in town and no invite to meet her. There's a restaurant I knew they'd be going to, so I basically went there with a friend at the same time and Ugh. pretended to run into them. <laughs> I and he pretended introduced to me run as into them, a Josh. friend. Uh, <laughs> got the friend introduction we got into a fight but i'm mad that he called me his friend and he's mad that i stalked them and won't even address the friend thing what should i do wow. uh, do this guy a favor and uh, leave him alone for the rest of your life <laughs> <laughs> you know what he might have been saving you the hassle of dealing with his mom maybe she was super critical so as opposed to or maybe he's just yeah. not that into you and he doesn't want your mom to meet you i was trying to be a little bit more optimistic. <laughs> I, 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 going I, to eat the mom to meet the mom. That's such a strange. Yeah, I think she she made the wrong move though. That's yeah. Yeah, that's not a cool move. No, no. of course not. Very stalkish. You yeah. don't do that. They're yeah. they're doomed. Break up. Are you familiar with the term <laughs> familiarity breeds contempt? <laughs> <laughs> you might want to take a look at that one. Okay. You know, I'm, I'm not sure how to get out of it, but, uh, yeah, I, I don't see a, a You positive. might move on from That's it eventually. It. You know what? I bet the mom would have peer pressured him to get married right away, and so he didn't want to mess with no. it, too. No. There's <laughs> parents out there that No, that. maybe she'd be very judgmental. Well, yeah. you can do better than that. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Strumpet. Round After heels. six months? Round heels. I don't think I'd want to meet a mom. <laughs> After six months. Yeah, this Isn't lady's a wife. too soon, or is that... Yeah, I think that's not... Too soon. She's... Yeah, yeah. Ma'am, ma you're really not... We've already discussed you way too much. Okay, <laughs> let's, let's move You're on. Simply to our, not worth our time. Move on to our next letter. Thank you, Josh. <laughs> We're very important. Dear people. Allie, <laughs> I got into a fight with my boy, with my husband. Sorry, and actually moved out of our house for almost a month. I was drinking the night that I left, and I used to be pretty wild. And I had the idea to drive directly to his friend's house, and I ended up sleeping with him. Oh. I stayed there for three days. Oh. Then. I went to stay with my sister for the rest of the time. Now you say, ma'am, ma'am, you say you used to be wild. <laughs> now, <laughs> what would you have done back in the old days? Oh, sorry. I can only imagine. Um, okay, so then I, I went to stay with my sister. My husband finally called, then sent flowers, and has been begging for me to come back. I just decided to move back in. I swore to his friend that we should never tell. He promised to do the same. Um, but now he keeps sending me inappropriate texts, and I'm getting nervous. What do I do? Oh, well, yikes. You're a terrible person. Hold on. We need to know the context really, of why really they were awful. fighting to begin with that she left. No, we don't. Maybe oh, he don't. was a horrible person, and oh. she was just, you know, a little uh, revenge so I don't know, But I th the issue is, is wow. as you move forward here, you've got the uh, the best friend fellow texting you yeah this is not going to end well no. yeah yeah this is no. rough. Mm. yeah <laughs> I, I, I mean do you think the best friend will tell if she doesn't sleep with him again or you think no he'll not as long as she, to get her drunk and sleep with him not as long as she gives him ten thousand dollars every month <laughs> 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 that's the way that's the way josh and i'd write it for the hallmark movie turned bad <laughs> yeah that hallmark movie quickly became a lifetime movie. yeah right <laughs> Yeah. Hallmark from hell. Uh, He's going to tell wow. the friend anyway. The next time they're drunk or something, or if he gets mad at his friend, I know he's going to let it slip. Just to be like, oh, yeah? yeah. Well, I banged your wife. Hmm. And it's oh. over. Yeah, that's, that may be accurate. Yeah, this is a, there's a big, this is going to be a problem in the future. Next time, sleep with a stranger. Yeah. Oh, they're yeah, uh, not his so friend. Rock solid. solid. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Rock uh, solid. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, let's go to our we next letter. Solved one. <laughs> Allie. Dear Allie, my wife and I have been married for 19 years. 
The last time we tried to have sex was on Christmas Eve of 2022. Oh, my God. Uh, shall, I say, shall I say I had a failure to launch? Mm. Since then, she's had zero interest, and every time I try to initiate, she simply says, well, I guess we can't. Uh, is one thing related to the other? Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. I would think <laughs> so, yeah. I mean, it, yeah. May, it may not have started that way, but she's certainly compounding the issue uh, with that yeah. kind of attitude. Sure. That's so mean. What was the what did the, what were the exact words she used? Well, I guess uh, yeah. What were they? I guess we can't. I guess we can't. Oh, Mr. Okay. Softy. Oh, I, mean, I see. I'm flying. You okay. can't. Yeah. Good yeah, lord, Mr. Yeah. I say weenie wink. Do the towel trick. He can't. He can't. What's that? He can't. He Tom. can't do the towel trick. You're He's rubbing got it in a his softy. face too. Oh, sorry. Yeah, thanks. You mean it's softy all the time? Yes, that's the it's, problem. But well, she's not helping. You need to go to. You need to go to a, a qualified to a medical professional and to get, talk him get through. Get the little blue pill. Come Maybe on. you have a. Uh, uh, pl- are they blue? Mm-hmm. All, it's not all, just all physical. Not all of them, but though this is now being. <laughs> Again, compounded by, by her. Yeah, that's yeah. Whatever letter is next, can can you pl- can it please reestablish my belief that there are good women out there? No, the, th- the three we've had so far just awful. There are good women out there. Well, Josh. I'm just they seem to be in the minority now. <laughs> okay, well, let's get to our next letter, Allie. What do we? What's got? redeemable? Dear Allie, I met a girl online who I really like who acts very shy and demure. Uh, It took a month before we actually had sex, which I didn't mind at all. But when we did, I found out that she had a tramp stamp. Seems odd, right? I don't mind if she's not actually so shy. I just mind if she's lying about it. Am I being crazy and overreacting? Yes. Yes, you are. Now we got dumb dumb guys. Yes. Yeah, Yeah. I I think Christy's got the answer to this one. (laughs) Where would the tramp stamp come from? Probably a drunk spring break trip. All the girls got them at Mm -hmm. one particular point in time, and now they're stuck with them. It kind of depends what it is. If it's like a Roman numeral, you go, why do you have a 17 on there? Oh, that's the number of times I've, you know... (laughs) <laughs> Why does it keep getting crossed out and raised? Yeah. <laughs> you mean butt stuff, don't yeah, you? Yeah, you're overreacting. <laughs> yeah, it, it could be, like Christy said, just a drunken yeah, spring break. Not all tramp stamps are sexual. Yeah, right. My, just, gra- my grandfather's was very <laughs> handsome looking. It was very nice. They had a nice World War II plane on his back. Yeah. <laughs> now, is, if, didn't we have a news story saying that the tramp stamp has kind of gone out of style? Yes. Yeah, yeah it was yeah, a trend. Yeah, it has. See, yep. trends come and go. That's why you don't put them forever on your body. Yeah. Remember the barbed wire Well, now the trend is to oh, yeah. tattoo everywhere. Yeah, people yeah. have full sleeves now, though. They yeah. don't have trends. Well, the barbed wire thing, that's, that's, that's still around. I know, because people got it when it, Pam Anderson did it, when it was a trend. Yeah, and that's now, very Jersey Shore. Pam Anderson's so cool. Esque. The coolest. <laughs> <laughs> She's not wearing makeup She's now. She's queen. so cool. Let's, uh, let's, let's move forward here, <laughs> Allie. What else do we have in the realm of romance? Dear Allie, my husband and I got married 18 years ago. He's older, and he said he'd take care of me completely if we got married, and I'd never have to work again. (laughs) We have a son who's about to go to college, and now he says he's going to retire. And since we have so many expenses, maybe I should get a job while he actually can can spend his time at home. I'm curious, but my friends are telling me uh, I've been taking care of for so long that it's not crazy, and I should probably agree. What should I do? Get a job. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> kind of they had an agreement. I, yeah. I, wouldn't right. you want to get out of the house, too, if he's home more? All the time? That's like what hobby? I would think, too. Yeah. Have oh, yeah. Did, you, did you see the girls chime in on that one? <laughs> yeah. Well, how do you feel now, Josh? Oh, my God. The three, get, uh, if the, he's going to be in the house, we got to get out the hell out of here. <laughs> the three witches. <laughs> bubble, yeah. bubble, bubble. Boil and trouble. <laughs> I'm in love with him as long as he's not around me. <laughs> he's paying worked my hard. bills. He's worked hard. Let him rest. Let How him can relax. I miss you if Chill. you won't leave? Yeah. That's, there's, <laughs> I, I think the guy make might the like kid. it. Yeah. Make the kid pay for college. That's right. Really, I'm still going to stay home and you go get a job. <laughs> <laughs> Seems reasonable. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't right. know. I don't have any answers for that one. All right. Okay. Well, let's move on then. Uh, Josh has nothing for you. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> Dear Allie, my boyfriend's dog is always trying to join in our sex. <laughs> Not just watch, but actually join in. Oh, my oh, yeah. God. Uh, What's thinks- the problem? <laughs> <laughs> hey, you want to have hot sex or not? <laughs> he seems to think it's funny, but it's taking all the romance out of everything. Okay, first the of all, stop, is- stop. It is hilarious. <laughs> yeah. okay. It is. Let's not lose sight of that. Yeah. <laughs> it's taking the romance out of all of it. 
he actually lives in a studio. So the only option is to lock the dog in the bathroom. And then the dog literally just barks like crazy, which doesn't help. Oh, what man. should I do? Get a crate. Yeah. Well, we need more information. Yeah. So is the dog see. hot? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like long lashes. Yeah. Right, right. Yeah. Like, a, like an Afghan hound, you know, something with flowing mm -hmm. lungs. You could do a variation of that famous scene in... Uh, that that famous scene in Last Tango in Paris where Brando's trimming his nails. Uh, here we go. Yeah, you get to the guy's house. He's what, why are you filing down the doggy's nails? I guess we oh, should. Well, you got any butter? Uh, you see oh. any scratches? Oh. Yeah. Oh. Don't hear about that more often. Oh, I, guess, <laughs> I, I I'm assume. Did she say anything about how they why they can't go to her place or? Oh no, that's a change of venue has got to happen. <laughs> Can you wait yeah. to feed the yeah. dog and, like, give the dog a bunch of, like, food in the bathroom and then you knock one out? Oh. So, so then he's distracted? Any dog's going to eat it all right. in two minutes. Yeah. Put it in a puzzle yeah. game. Oh, yeah. Yeah, well, let it work a puzzle. Guys can knock what? It out in they have two puzzle. Too. They have puzzle food <laughs> dishes. No, no, I meant yeah. like a jigsaw puzzle. Oh, yeah. What's that sconch or thing? Whatever it is, you can put peanut butter in. Oh, the Kong toy. ball. Or, yeah. Kong ball. Yeah. Freeze it. Yeah, Freeze might, a Kong ball, put that, them in the bathroom. That's actually a pretty good a bad idea. idea. Yeah. yeah. That might keep the dog yeah. occupied for a while. Hmm. Or just a big bone, exactly. Something that would be... Uh, well, <laughs> speaking of big bone. I mean, yeah. That's what he's trying to get One that's not attached to a body. <laughs> I got a big bone for each of you. Oh, or bring a girl dog in. I wonder if she's worried what's happening when uh, she's not home. Josh, yeah. the dog wants to join in. That's, I mean, man. Come on. Hey, let me get some of that, huh? <laughs> bark, bark, bark. Let's yeah. go. Come on. I'm putting the peanut butter there for a reason there, babe. Hello. Okay. You guys are assuming it's a guy, it's a guy dog. It could be a oh. girl dog. Oh, hey. Yeah, man. that's true. Mm -hmm. Oh, kinky. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, yeah, got to have an open mind here. Didn't yeah. Jerry Springer I used know. to interview a guy that was married to a golden retriever or something? Really? Black, wasn't it a black lab, I think? Was it a... Yeah. Or maybe they Married to a horse. Boy, once yeah. you go black lab. <laughs> wow. You never go back lab. Okay, I'm sorry. Let's get we have one more letter, Allie. What do you got? Uh, and, and if that was, if the one that we, there's a devil's threesome, I wonder what you call the threesome with the dog. Oh. That's got to be an interesting oh. Well, all right. Dear Allie. My uh, menage a, wait a minute, Josh. Mm, yeah, we menage can figure this out. A, um, uh, no, that wouldn't be it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Doggy star. Oh, what's a good dog name that starts with a T? Fido? No, that's an F. Mm, that's an F. Uh, okay, we'll work on that. Oh. All right. Uh, I'm sorry, yeah, Allie. Someone's got to come up with that. Yeah, in the comments, let us know. Dear Allie, my boyfriend always tells me I'm very spoiled and I always get my way. Meanwhile, I'm the one who usually treats him to dinner when we go out. I cook, I clean, and he just occasionally rubs my feet. I love him, but he acts like he's treating me like a princess, and that's just not the case. Do you think he really feels this way, or is he gaslighting me? Uh, he's not. Ga there's no gaslighting going on here, but I... I um... Hmm. He, yeah, he probably thinks he is spoiling you in a way. He's like, what do you want from me? I did something. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. What, what is he putting into it? I rubbed your feet for three seconds. Foot, the occasional foot massage. Yeah. That's does it? He, yeah, that's what it sounds like. Or does he, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Please start calling him princess all the time. Like, don't worry, princess. I'll take care of dinner. I'll clean, princess. And he will get so mad, and it'll be amazing. And yeah. he'll never call you a princess again. He'll figure it out. <laughs> and then you guys can break up, and you'll oh, be happy. <laughs> you know, olsman has been in a relationship longer than any of us. Did you guys know that? I know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. There's logic to this. <laughs> hmm. Man. She's right though i think about that that is so annoying i would get annoyed by that yeah just if because he's like you're so it. spoiled yeah yeah Okay, well, um, uh, that's our, our episode of, uh, <laughs> of, of that concludes this you sound episode like Mr. Of, 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 of sexy time. I think we were helpful. Super yeah, duper. There are a couple. Are you doing something special for Valentine's Day? <laughs> no, nothing. Oh. Nothing at all. Yeah. Do you have I a present? Valentine's do, Day really? It's kind of an annoying holiday. Do you have a present for your man? Uh, nope, not that either. Maybe I'll think of something. Wait a minute, but, what are we talking yeah. about? Our next episode will be on Valentine's Day. Yeah, it will. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's cool. Yep. Yeah. Well, well, well. Somebody well, will break well. up on Valentine's Day because of us. Yeah. If that ain't love, I'll kiss your ass. <laughs> the Valentine's Day edition. Well, thanks, Allie. Thanks, guys. Bye, Bye Allie. Bye. Bye.